Yeah, brothers. Call hello, you how about Shim Yao Shab by Shim Kokadash. Yeah, I had to uh let the uh, video overlap. But yeah, let me finish this. I was in Ezekiel 30 and 6. That said, the Lord, you have by Shem Yahushai, they also that uphold Egypt shall fall, and the pride of her power shall come down. From the tower of Sein shall they fall in it by the sword, said the Lord, you have. And what's going to be that sword, man? That glittering sword that come over here, man. And also, uh, uh, fucking guns, race wars, uh, a, 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 a whole heap of more uh, things the Lord going to bring to you damn devils, all right? And this is, uh, Leviticus 26 and 19. It says, And I will break the pride of your power, and I will make your heaven as iron, and your earth as, as, as brass, and your strength shall be sent, spent in vain, for your land shall not yield her increase, neither shall the trees of the land yield for fruits. And if ye walk contrary unto me, and will not hearken to me, I will bring seven times more plagues upon you according to your sins, man. And the Lord say, uh, uh, the sins, the, the equity of, of this damn place, the, the great whore, the harlot has reached up. Man, the Lord has remembered her sins reached up to the heavens, man. The Lord is going to reward seven times a complete number according to which ultimately is going to lead to nukes being sent to this land and destroying two-thirds of Israel and all you fucking Edomites, all right? With, with more harsh death, too, including famine, the uh, teeth of wild beasts, the sword, death and destruction, all right? And all you heathens, all right? Anybody who's celebrating this damn wicked-ass day, man, death to you, all right? This is uh Psalms chapter 10 verse 2. The wicked in his pride do persecute the poor. Let them be taken in the devices that they have imagined. Yeah, y'all persecute the poor. Got them celebrating down July 4th like his damn uh a, a fucking uh, uh, uh this is supposed to be the Sabbath day, man. You people, bro. Bro, woo. Man, you be taken in the in uh let me read that again. The wicked in his pride don't persecute the poor. Let them be taken in the devices in, that they have to imagine. Yeah. Let you be taken in the devices that you imagine. You believe that you're a patriot and you proud and America's going to go on forever. All right. Let you be taken in that. All right. When the, when the nukes come hit your ass. All right. You take that. You take that pride to the grave with you, man. All right. Let's say verse four. The wicked through the pride of his continence will not seek after your how. Yeah. You say God bless America, man. But you're not seeking after uh. God, all right, the fuck, man, not not the way you institute and, and govern and, and let uh this bullshit gay marriage, all right, uh go on in this country and all this other wickedness that goes on in America. With it's it's a heap hope, a, a, a heap of that shit, man. All right, it said the wicked through the pride of his countenance will not seek after Yahweh. Yahweh is not. In, in all his thoughts, you're not thinking about the Lord, man. All right, when you say God bless America, man, you you thinking about uh the Lord uh increasing this land and making it uh land to go on for more and more, man. But the Lord's gonna throw this shit down. He's gonna bring this shit down. It's gonna fall. All right, the the fucking virgin daughter of Babylon, uh, you're gonna be destroyed. All right, this is Psalms 59 and 12. For the sin of their mouth and the words of their lips, let them even be taken in their pride and for cursing and lying which they speak. And that's all y'all do is curse and lie, all right? Saying that uh, America is a great country, all right? Make America great again, all right? Proud to be American, man. Proud to be a patriot, man. All right, that's all lies, man, all right? Because you devils are going to be destroyed, man, all right? It, 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 it's nothing to be proud about to be a damn demon, man. A murderer, a thief, and a rapist, man, all right? That, that's, uh... That's not upholding the laws of Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shah. All right. This is uh, Psalm 73 and 6. Therefore, pride com compassed them as a chain, violence covered them as a garment. Yeah, and that violence is, is covered all y'all like a damn garment. All right. We know who the damn true murderers are. We know who the damn most violent people are. All right. We know who. Uh, Who's the most prideful, haughty motherfucker there is, man? All right, it's you damn Edomites, all right, who instituted this land off of uh, mass genocide and, uh, and mass murdering, mass slaughtering uh, millions of, 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 of Ru uh, Reuben, Reubenites and Gadites, man. All right, and you got all right, people celebrating this damn wicked ass day, man. This is crazy. This is vexation of spirit, man. 
just to be here in this wicked ass place, man. This is uh Proverbs eleven and two. When pride come, then come shame. All right. So you want to be pride, then you're gonna be ashamed. All right. And you damn Edomites are ashamed to be Edomites right now, man. All right. You trying to hide from the fact? Oh, we just proud to be Americans. I'm proud to be American, but I'm not proud how the country was instituted. All right. I ain't have nothing to do with what with, with, with happened uh, off in, in this country, man. I just live here, man. That wasn't me. All right. But I got a precept for you, damn devils. All right. You want to say that it wasn't you who, who, who did, who instituted this country of rape, um, murder, and robbery? Okay. This is uh, Isaiah 14 and 21. Prepare slaughter for his children. All right. So prepare slaughter for his children. All right. For the iniquity of their fathers. Yeah, for the iniquity of, of your fathers. Prepare slaughter for your ass. All right. It says, they, they, they do not rise nor possess the land. You're not going to possess this land no more, you damn devils. All right. Nor feel the face of the world with cities. Yeah, you're not gonna feel uh the the face of the world with your ugly ass Edomite leprous face no more. All right, you damn demons. All right, for the iniquity of your fathers. All right, that, that's your damn fault, man. You ain't got nobody to blame for that, man. All right. Let me also let me go one chapter back, Isaiah 13 and 9. Behold, the day of the Lord cometh. Cruel both with wrath and fierce anger. All right. The Lord is coming with fierce anger for you damn devils, man. All right. It says, to lay the land desolate and he shall destroy the sinners thereof out of it. Every single one of you motherfuckers are, are, are damn sinners, man. All right. And he's going to lay this bitch desolate. All right. And then we jump down to 19. In Babylon, the glory of the kingdoms. Yeah, the glory of the kingdoms, man. All right. The land that was once so great, man. It went so uh beautiful, man. All right. It says the the beauty of the Chaldees excellence and who's the Chaldees? All right, you damn Edomites. All right. It says shall be as when Yahweh overthrew Sodom and Gomorrah, and you know how uh Yahweh by Shem Yahushai overthrew uh Sodom and Gomorrah. He burnt that bitch up uh with with fire and brimstone from the sky, man. All right, which which is gonna be uh them them nuclear missiles that's gonna rain and come blow this bitch up, man. All right. This is Isaiah 14 and 4. That thou shalt not take up this proverb against the king of Babylon and say, How have the oppressors ceased? The golden city ceased. Yeah, how, 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 did, uh, how, how did this come to an end, man? How did your uh, rulership, how did this golden city that was so great, man, that everybody was proud to be a uh, citizen of, how was it going um, to be brought down, man? All right. This is Isaiah 21 and 9. And behold, here cometh a chariot of man with a couple of horsemen. And he answered and said, Babylon is fallen, is fallen. All the graven images of her gods, he have broken unto the ground. Yeah, this is a uh, damn false idolatry to uh, praise uh, damn uh, pre uh, the presidents and damn John Adams and T Thomas Jefferson. Some damn murderers and some thieves, man. All right. Because how they uh, cause they wrote the damn Declaration of Independence, man. All right. Because. Uh, they 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 did uh this and that man all right you know and this is satan fucking with me man all right let, let me in the dodge shatan all right get this in, in revelations man this is revelations 18 one of my favorite chapters this is revelations 18 and 10, standing afar off for fear of her torment, saying, Alas, alas, the great city Babylon, that mighty city, for in one hour is thy judgment come. The Lord gonna come fuck this place up in one hour, man. <laughs> all right, y'all did all this building and all this killing, man, to, to build this country up, man, and celebrate the 4th of July. The Lord gonna destroy this shit in one hour, man, all right? And this is... Uh, Revelation 18 and 21. And a mighty angel took up a stone like a great millstone and cast it into the sea, saying, Thus with violence shall the great city Babylon be thrown down and shall be found no more at all. Yeah, the same way you instituted this land of violence and murder, the same way it's going to be thrown down when the Lord come destroy this bitch. All right. And, 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 man, I can't wait till the Lord come destroy this. I can wait, you know, but I'll be happy when the Lord come destroy this bitch, man, off the face of the earth, man. All right. Let me get this in Obadiah. Got a couple more scriptures. Get ready to wrap it up soon. This is Obadiah 1 and 3. 
The pride of thine heart have deceived thee, thou that dwellest in the clefts of the rocks, whose habitation is high, that said in his heart, who shall bring me down to the ground? Yeah, the pride of your heart didn't deceive you, man. All right, because the Lord going to come destroy this bitch in one hour, man. <laughs> you, you thought this was going to go on forever, man. All right, you thought you was going to do what the hell you wanted to do. And, and you thought you was going to get away with murdering millions of Israelites, man. And, and the Lord just going to let you go on and be okay, man. You got, man, you people, bro. You damn Edomites, man. This is Zephaniah 2 and 10. This shall they have for their pride because they have reproached and magnified themselves against the people of the Lord of hosts. The Lord will be terrible unto them for he will famish all the gods of the earth and men shall worship him everywhere from his place, even all the isles of the heathen. You're going to worship the Lord, man. All right, you damn devils. Hey, 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 this what this what you're going to do for trying the Lord, man. You got, man, you thought the Lord going to let you uh, uh, keep on worshiping your damn gods, Satan. Man, fuck you, man. All right. This uh Baal and Balaam. Man, come on, man. This is Zephaniah 3 and 11. In that day shall thou not be ashamed for all thy doings when thou hast transgressed against me. For then I will take away out of the midst of them that rejoice in thy pride. And thou shalt no more be haughty because of my holy mountain. Yeah. And that's why you uh not haughty no more. That's why that uh that nature of patriotism and, and pride is, is declining in America. Okay, because you got uh, the man of the Lord speaking out against you, damn devils. All right, and and, and now uh, it, it's being brought down. Them, them strongholds that you have built have been brought or are being brought down, man. Because the man of the Lord are pushing his word out, man. All right, I'm gonna go to uh, First John two and sixteen. It says, "For all that is in the world." The lust of the flesh and the lust of the eyes and the pride of life is not of the Father, but of the world. And the world passeth away, and the lust thereof, and he that doeth the will of Yahweh will abide forever. So all the, all the things in this world are going to pass away. All your 4th of July barbecues and picnics and cookouts, man, and fun that you want to have on, on, on this day, it's going to pass away, man. This shit not going to be no more. We're not going to be celebrating the 4th of July in the kingdom, man. All right? All the, all the lust of the world, man. All, all this damn demon shit you people want to be involved. Damn, man. All right. This is Isaiah 47 and 1. Come down and sit in the dust, O virgin daughter of Babylon. Sit on the ground. There is no throne. I ain't no throne over here no more, man. Y'all don't run shit. Oh, daughter of the Chaldeans, for thou shalt no more be called tender and th delicate. Yeah, you're not going to be called tender and delicate no more. Why? Because you're going to get your ass touched, man. All right. You're not going to be that virgin daughter, man. All right. You're going to get your ass fucked up. The Lord got death coming for you, man. And I'm going to get this in Jeremiah, and I'm going to wrap it up, man. Lord willing, this was edifying for you, brothers. All right. This is Jeremiah. Chapter 21. Verse 10. It says, For I have set my face against this city for evil and not for good, said the Lord Yahweh Bashim El Shah. It, be, it shall be given into the hand of the king of Babylon and he shall burn it with fire. <laughs> the Lord done gave this uh, vision to the hand of uh, Donald J. Trump, man. <laughs> All right, and Donald J. Trump, man, he got uh, you people from the gate, boy. Woo. Man, Donald J. Trump, man, he, he's the right one to pop this bitch off, man. All right, so, uh, this bitch gonna be burnt with fire. All right, that's what you got to look for uh, in America right now. You wanna uh, worship this damn land, be a part of uh, damn July Fourth, be a patriot, be proud to be American. All right, the Lord is gonna kill you. All right, and He's gonna kill all you fucking Edomites. Death to you Edomites. Death to you heathens. And death to you two third niggas who celebrate this fucking day. All right. I want to be a part of this day. I want to be a part uh, of Babylon. All right. Fuck you. All right. May the Lord kill you. All right. Uh, Kahala Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah Bashim Kokadash. All right. Shalom to the elect.